Hi, and welcome back to this tutorial on how to download Tropomi NO2 data. For this one, I'm going to show how to use method, method number three, search.earthdata.nasa.gov website. So for that one, I have it loaded already here. Um, but before getting any further, I have to, I want to let you know that I do use this Chrome extension called Chrono Download Manager to help me download the data. So I encourage you to stop the video here, install this on your computer if you want to uh, download the data in the exact same way that I do it. <clears throat> All right, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to search for the instrument that we're interested in. Um, we're going to search for Trobomi. Um, it's going to load up here. Okay. And so this will just load up all of the products from uh, as, that are processed um, from Tropomi. Um, we have a variety of chemical constituents, uh, NO2, carbon monoxide, etc. Um, and so I'll go through these a little bit here. So we have the Tropomi Mines NO2 product. This is processed by NASA. It's currently, as of today, September 2022, it's only available until the end of uh, 2021. So if your time range is before December 2021, you might want to select this one. Um, but you have a more recent date, then you want to scroll down and you'll actually want to select this option here, um, uh, the S5P L2 N2 uh, high HIR. Um, but if you had a time frame, say before August, of um, 2019, you'll have to scroll all the way down to get um, this option here, where it's seven by three and a half B1, or if you have some time between um, August 2019 and July of 2021, you wanna do this option here. I understand it's a little confusing, but that's how it's organized on the NASA website. All right, so we're gonna want a more recent day. So we're gonna select this option right here. <clears throat> and, um, so this will have every single um, overpass. We're gonna have 6,000 files. That's way too many to download for our particular application. So let's sort by both location and time frame. So let's just say we just want August of 2022. So start August 1st and we'll end um, the end of August here, August 31st. All right, so now we are narrowed it down to 439 overpasses. That's still a lot. Wouldn't recommend doing all of that. So um, next thing we're gonna do is um, uh, just search for a small domain. So again, if we want just the Eastern United States, we're gonna click um, this spatial um, uh, tool at the top left here. We want just like a, a rectangle, a small domain. We'll just say the Eastern United States here. That's all we're concerned about for this particular project. And then with that, we have now 62 um, files to download. This is still going to be a quite a large um, download, but much smaller than the 6,000 that we had previously. All right, so we'll go click download all. It'll take us a few seconds here, about 35 gigabytes uh, just for one single month of data over the Eastern United States. Quite a bit, quite large um, for many users purposes, but other people who have terabytes worth of data, not too, too large. So let's click done, want the direct download, um, then go to download the data. This again will get us all of the data for August of uh, 2022. All right, and so then in the last step here, we're going to click the uh, application on the right here. Top right, this is again, the Chrono Download Manager. Um, it's gonna sniff that's their terminology, not mine, of the, the page. And we're going to try and find the NetCDF files to download. It's actually under Other. And we click the 62 files. Um, I'm not going to download it right now because it's uh, 35 gigabytes to my local computer, which I'm not going to do. But if um, um, for you, this would, if I click download all, it will download all 62 files to your computer. Um, there's other ways to download the files here um, using a download script. And AWS, I uh, encourage you to check out the directions on the website if you're interested in those methods. Thanks for this version of the tutorial. Um, I'll be back soon with the last version.